in Rome. Well, despite the warnings from the WHO, there are glimmers of positivity I mean, amid the coronavirus pandemic. As new cases dwindle in China, it is slowly emerging from lockdown. People are being told to go back to work while maintaining social distancing. The government has also announced new measures to test people who aren't showing symptoms. Here's our China media analyst, Kerry Allen. It's very much the case for a lot of people in China now that they're starting to get back to seeing a version of normal in the country. So what that means is a lot of businesses are starting to reopen and children are starting to go back to school for the first time. But at the same time, people are still really worried that COVID-19 might see a resurgence within the country, either due to people who've been traveling in from overseas or because there might be people who are asymptomatic. So they might be carrying the virus, but they might not necessarily have a fever or a cough. Now, what the government's done is today it's said that it's going to start testing people who are asymptomatic and uh, start monitoring these people and checking them if they do display positive results for COVID-19. But also Xi Jinping has really stepped up measures of testing people uh, using AI. So one of the things that he's been doing in the last 24 hours is visiting an urban management center in Hangzhou where they run AI in in cities um, to track people. And he's been saying that it's really important now that they have the measures in place to be able to track where there are concentrations of people. And uh, and people are starting to respond to this. So businesses, for example, they're taking temperature checks when people visit their premises. And they're also asking that people scan a QR code code on their phone, which is almost like a barcode. And this means that, say, if somebody further down the line exhibits symptoms of the coronavirus or they test positive, it means that they can be traced, but also anybody they come into contact with can also be traced. Kerry Allen. Meanwhile, 